This is The Big Story presented by HerbChambers.com. My name is Milton Valencia. I'm a Metro reporter with the Boston Globe, and I'm just getting back from federal court where we heard bombshell testimony in the corruption trial of former House Speaker Salvatore F. DeMacy. We heard from Stephen Tapazio, a former associate of DeMacy, who, who testified and for the first time brought DeMacy into this elaborate scheme to allegedly steer two software contracts to Burlington Software Cognos in exchange for thousands of dollars in kickbacks. Tapazio shared law space, uh, the office space, with DeMacy around 2004, years earlier, but around 2004, when DeMacy told him uh, that he was going to bring a new client for, uh, for him to handle. Tapazio immediately thought it was a little strange. It was a corporate client, not his type of work, but uh, he didn't argue either when he was told he would get a $5,000 a month retainer. Uh, from there, because it was a referral, he started to pay DeMacy uh, $4,000 a month, and that totaled to $65,000 in, uh, in total payments to DeMacy. All along, according to prosecutors, that money was coming from the same software company that DeMacy was helping to get a, a two state contracts. Those contracts totaled $17.5 million. This is just one part of the scheme uh, in which DeMacy got money as part of this broader kickback scheme alleged uh, in, in federal court. Tapasio said he, he grew particularly concerned when he was hired uh, for a six-month contract and that contract was renewed, but he was never asked to perform any work. Uh, not only that, but the contract he signed was for a lobbying contract, something he didn't do. When he raised concerns with some of the salesmen with, with Cognos, they told him, take it or leave it. He also raised concerns with, uh, with De DeMacy, who told him not to, quote, screw it up, close quote. Uh, DeMacy uh, also, according to DePazio, seemed more concerned with getting the business than anything else. We didn't get into this in federal court today. We're going to resume uh, in Thursday, but we're also expecting DePazio to... Uh, to testify that once the you know different officials, once the FBI began investigating, he raised concerns with with DeMacy, saying, you know what, I have this payment in my check register, and uh, and it reflects the payment that I received, and also the payment that I gave to you. And apparently, we're expecting this testimony that DeMacy told Tapazio, uh, it'd be nice if you could lose your check register. Uh, prosecutors are saying that's an admission of guilt right there, something that showed he knew what he was doing was wrong.